Hello, today we're going to talk about the Matrix Protocol. It is a secure communication platform that you can use for messaging, voice and video calls, and file sharing. The Matrix Protocol is similar to WhatsApp, Discord, and Telegram, but it is also open source and decentralized. Decentralization is a core feature of Matrix, and it comes with several advantages over centralized communication platforms. First and foremost, decentralization means that there's no central authority controlling the network. This makes it much more difficult for governments and other entities to monitor or censor communications. Secondly, decentralization means that users have more control over their own data. With centralized platforms, users have to trust the platform provider to protect their data and privacy. But with Matrix, users can choose their own server and client, and their data is encrypted and stored securely. And if they can't find a server they trust, they can even create their own. Finally, decentralization means that Matrix can be more resilient than centralized platforms. With no central point of failure, the network can continue to function even if some servers are compromised or taken offline. Now that we've talked about what makes Matrix great, I can show you how to use the protocol. To start with, you'll need an account. Account creation in Matrix works the same way email does. You can choose what server you want, such as Proton or Gmail, but you can still send messages to people who use a different server. Joinmatrix.org has a list of public servers you can choose from, and there is no right server, so you can just pick whichever sounds nice. To register, just click on the link in the registration method column. Most of these link to an element web client where you can register with a username, password, and sometimes email. Now you'll need to choose a client. A lot of servers have an Element web client, but I prefer and recommend downloading a client. I would suggest using Element to start with since it's a great client that works on every platform. Once you have a feel for it, you can experiment with other clients to see if there's one that fits you better. Matrix is organized into rooms and places. Rooms are group chats and places are groups of rooms. You can also treat the places and rooms like servers and channels on Discord. To join a room or place, you'll need an invite link, alias, or identifier. I'll put invite links to my place and a couple others that you can try out. If you have someone's username, you can start a chat with them. In the chat, you can send text messages, share files, and make voice and video calls. To make group chats, just create a private room and invite all the people you want into it. And there you have it, a quick video about why Matrix is great, the advantages of decentralization, and a quick guide on how to use Matrix. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. Thanks for watching.